Hey guys, what's up? It's Nuclear Videos HD, and I'm here with the Simpsons Tapped Out Superheroes Update Number Two, Issue One. Seems like they have a very, very unorganized way of releasing content into the stores. Today, I just logged in, and a message popped up saying that Wind Lad and Citizen Solar have been released into the store to be purchased. Now, yesterday when I logged in, there was a similar text box saying that the satellite station was also released into the store so kinda just seems like they're just throwing random stuff into the store at random times not sure if it's the same time for everybody else I'm sure it is but um, I didn't see anywhere like online that any of these things were being released you know on these days so um, I didn't want to ignore the content and these characters so I decided just to make this small video so this is Windlad right here he comes in a combo with Citizen Solar, I had that on film, but the game just kept crashing so, so much that I just decided, you know what, this is so embarrassing to even upload, so I'm not even going to bother, so I'm just going to redo the video a little bit, but Windlad and Citizen Solar come together in a combo, I believe it was either 160 donuts or 130, but they're both voiced characters, even though they both have only one string of dialogue, so uh, Windlad can say... Yeah, that was kind of low. Let me just play that again. So he can play. Don't like the noise I make. And that's pretty much the only string of dialogue he has. So he can dance in the wind for four hours, tell kids about windy energy, or tell kids about wind energy for 60 minutes, study the weather for eight hours, have a renewable energy party for 12, and blast off for 24. So we'll check out his dance in the wind. He kind of just propels around and... Has fun with his wind, so. Okay. So that is all you need for Wind Lad. And Citizen Solar can bathe in the sun for four hours, tell kids about solar energy for 60 minutes, study the weather for eight hours, have a renewable energy party for 12, and generate renewable energy for 24. So we'll give him his bathe in the sun task. So he's just enjoying that sun. Pretty cool. So his only string of dialogue is... It's too cloudy. So he's got that really nasally voice. So uh, it's pretty much everything that there is for Citizen Solar and Wind Lad. I've never enjoyed the blazing, scorching, unbearing sun more. There hasn't been more hot air blowing since the last GOP debate. Okay. So, they have their own little string of dialogue, which we'll go through. Um, you guys can go through that on your own. Um, there's some other stuff that I noticed I want to cover in this video real quick. You guys go into your superheroes guide, whatever you want to call it. Um, you go down to your felon management. It seems as though you can unlock felons who you can take to other Springfield or uh, other neighboring Springfields and attack them. Similar to the way that you defend your Springfield, you go to neighboring Springfields and, and attack them. So instead of playing as the heroes, you're playing as these these villains, which is pretty cool. Um, I haven't had a chance to go do that. I, I mean, I have, but every single time I'm about to finish the fight, it just crashes. So um, that's unfortunate, but I'm sure for you guys, you know, you can go in there and do that. Um, it's pretty cool, you know, you get to play as these guys and, you know, they have their own little moves and stuff. But um, it's pretty cool. Now, if you go down to the category below... You have social battle prizes, um, which I'm not really too, too sure of how you earn these. And uh, if it's the way that I think, I'm kind of screwed because it says, uh, it says over here when you go to the guide, it says use your felons to do battle with your friends' heroes, uh, play more battles to unlock felons and cool prizes. So I'm what I take from this is that you visit Springfields and then you attack their you know, their villain, or you attack their heroes and stuff, like, you know, like I just explained, and then once you do, like, for instance, for Tungsten Dude, you, once you do 10, 10 of those little battles, you earn him, and then so on and so forth, but like I said, I can't even visit my friend's towns, because it crashes like crazy, so I, I'm kind of screwed for that, um, but the prizes are Tungsten Dude, Science Water Cooler, Kiosk, Stem Antha, Trading Card Box, Gluteus, Pie Man Epic Statue, First Aid Kit, 
megahertz, and the One Week Wonder film. So to unlock these things, and you guys can unlock them all now, you just got to keep visiting friends' towns like crazy. You know, if you have 100 friends, that's, you know, 10 right here, 10 right here, 10 right here, and, you know, you could probably unlock all these prizes pretty quick if you have 100 friends and just go and visit them all, you know, every day. So pretty easy for those. I got to figure out a little bit more on how I can earn them because I'm very much screwed, you know, like I said, because my town is just way too laggy at the moment to do anything, but, um, you know, hopefully I can find a way around that and maybe my game will, will fix itself a little bit more and will be able to let me, you know, go and visit my neighbors a little bit more. So another thing that I noticed, like I mentioned a little bit earlier in the video, was that the... Uh, super satellite station or whatever it was called was released in the store the other day this is it right here it doesn't really do much um, like I said it was released in the store yesterday and I didn't make a video about it but now that we're here I might as well show it off it's not really not really too interesting but when you click on it it's got that kind of alien-esque uh, building sound harvesting free ions this is a building task it earns 170 knuckles, bass knuckles, and 75 XP every four hours. So the thing I notice about these kind of buildings, the ones that earn your special um, event item, like the knuckles or the cards or the band-aids or whatever, is you can speed them up with donuts. But if you go to any other random building, let's go to the Shishi Lounge, you cannot speed that up. So I guess that they just wanted to do this so... You know, if you have the donuts to speed up certain tasks that reward you with stuff for the update, that way you can do those things. But if you just want to speed up the Shishi Lounge to get your 200 donuts, can't do it anymore. Um, which I guess that makes sense. You know, they don't want to have to, you know, they want people to get as much of the, you know, content-related drops as possible. So, um, so that's pretty much everything for this. Um, yeah, it's going to crash. So not really too, too much going on. Citizen Solar Wind Lad and the Super Station Satellite thing are both in your stores. Not too sure what the next item to be released in the store is. I mean, these were back to back, so there sure as hell could be one released tomorrow. Um, if anything does happen, I'll definitely be sure to try and cover it. Um, it's just it's very unorganized this update. I mean, it for the most part it is pretty simple, but there's just a lot of other stuff like. In the past, everything was released at one time, and it was easy to show off. But now that things are like, oh, this will be released tomorrow at 2 o'clock, you know, it's kind of hard to cover everything because you don't know when everything's coming out. But I'll try my best to get all the content out for you guys and keep you guys updated on everything and show off all the content as I do. Hopefully you guys enjoy. Um, one more thing, real quick. If you guys keep on upgrading the Burn Summer Mansion, you now get... Like, the West Wing has been unlocked. So, the more you upgrade this thing, the more um, the more upgraded the building itself gets. So, you know, you can keep building this up bigger. I believe once you get to level 15 is when it gets to its final form. Let's just get there real quick. Oops. And the final one. So now, yeah, so now we have unlocked every part of the building. So now it's in its giant mansion form. Obviously, you can go in and you can uh, bring it down to Burn Summer Mansion, Mansion West Wing, Mansion Both Wings. You can go and switch through those if you'd like. So level 15, that's all you got to do for those. And I guess that they increase the radius of tapping those criminals for you guys. So pretty much everything that you guys can do, not really too much, but... Um, hope you guys enjoy it again. Those three three content, whatever you want to call it, the two characters in the building are in the store. And everything else you guys need to know, you guys need to learn anything else about the update itself, please be sure to check out the previous four videos of the uh, Act 1 walkthrough that I did. And uh, I'll see you guys next time with Act 2 or anything else that comes out. Keep on tapping, peace out, and enjoy the update. That's pretty much it. Thanks for watching and subscribe. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like. If you have any comments, questions, concerns, leave them down in the comments section below. Also, be sure to check out some of my other pages, including Instagram, Facebook, Google+, and Twitter, whose links will all be located in the description below. Also, feel free to email me at nuclearvideoshd at gmail.com. Keep on tapping, and peace out.